Scotian Halibut is a uh, Nova Scotia company um, founded in 1997. We are one of the uh, one of the top commercial halibut hatcheries in North America. When this facility was first constructed, it was the largest land-based seawater recirculating commercial aquaculture facility in North America. When we first started out, we had the aid of the Icelanders, and we have since, over the years, progressed into growing halibut for our own facility. So we've hired competent staff, uh, we've grown in ourselves, both technically, um, and, uh, and we've advanced now so that we are one of the uh, one of the top commercial halibut hatcheries in North America. Scotian halibut uh, has been operating out of Clark's Harbour and Woods Harbour, uh, southwestern Nova Scotia, um, and produces high-quality Atlantic halibut juveniles for farming. The market for farmed halibut is is extremely strong. Um, there's been a, a, a slow decline in the Pacific halibut uh, catches, which has left a lot of opportunity for uh, farm product to fill a, a missing market segment. Uh, also, uh, just Canada in general, um, there's a very strong market for Atlantic halibut regardless. It's considered the top whitefish uh, product in, in the marketplace and there's a constant demand for it. Uh, aquaculture in Canada um, has a phenomenal foundation um, that is just waiting to go forward and Scotian we've uh, over the past 10 years we've we've pretty well developed one of the best technical teams in the country for marine fish and anybody who wants to get into the business or wants to to, to work in marine fish um, usually knock on our door because they'd like to come and work Work with us and train. Our facility is a, a reuse farm. It means that we are reusing the water that comes from the fish, filtering it, clarifying it, sending it back to the fish to be reused. So in this part of our facility, we're filtering the water, removing any solids, uh, waste feed, and, and other waste that comes from the fish. And we're also removing ammonia that is toxic to the fish. We're removing carbon dioxide and then from here the water goes back to the fish tanks where we inject pure oxygen. So this, this uh, manipulation of the water helps to ensure optimal environmental conditions to grow the fish in. It typically takes around four years to raise a halibut from egg stage to a market size where it can be used for human consumption. Uh, some of the fish will go from here to other on-growing farms regionally. Uh, and others will be maintained at this site to be used as broodstock later on. Some will be held for, for market, to be grown to a market size. Another part that we're doing in this part of the farm is we're involved in a, a research project in partnership with the Agricultural College in Truro, Nova Scotia, in which we are growing seaweed in our reuse system for the purpose of removing nitrogen and phosphorus and nitrogen and phosphorus are the main components that lead to algal blooms in the environment, but removing those can also help to improve the water quality for the fish. Um, halibut farming is uh, an opportunity, it's probably the single biggest new species opportunity Canada has, um, and could easily be a $100 million industry in Atlanta, Canada over the next 10, 20 years. What's nice about the company is that uh, we can grow our own halibut, and we can grow them up to the size that we want, and we market a fillet. And it's a unique product that people typically can't get around here, and if you're eating a halibut fillet, chances are you're eating one of our fish.